Believe me, if my intent was to have a relationship with a woman, particularly a very attractive one, uh, I certainly wouldn't have gone about it this way. I invited press scrutiny. <laughs> That's when reporters posed a question that would forever change presidential campaign said, coverage. Uh, so you believe adultery is immoral? Yes, I do. Have you ever committed adultery? Uh, I do not know. I'm not going into a theological definition of what constitutes adultery. In some people's minds, it's people being married and having relationships with other people. Again, reporters asked if Hart had ever committed adultery. I do not need to answer that question. WMUR's John DeStaso was in the room that day. It was tense and intense. Uh, I've never been in a, a room with so many reporters. This was a whole new universe for uh, politics, really. Hart dropped out of the race a few days later. I believe I'd, I would have been a successful candidate, and I know I could have been a very good president, particularly for these times. But apparently now we'll never know. At the time, Granite Staters interviewed by WMUR were disappointed in both Gary Hart and the media, although it's important to point out again that the Colorado senator actually did invite reporters to look into his personal life. But like it or not, from then on, candidates seeking the White House faced a more intense and personal kind of scrutiny. Adam Sexton, WMUR News 9.